Over 4,000 people filled Military Park in Newark, New Jersey Saturday for Senator Cory Booker's first rally as a presidential candidate. He kicked off his Justice for All tour in his hometown, where he was once mayor and still has residents. I learned right here on these streets that you can't make progress by dividing people. New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy and State Senator Bob Menendez took the podium, but it was his mother who introduced him. Corey will be the kind of president whose leadership will bring our country together in the face of difficult challenges. Senator Booker, who is now one of 18 Democratic presidential candidates in the 2020 election, hyped up the crowd with his views on health care, pro-abortion rights, and stronger gun laws. We will invest in people their education, their mental health, treating addiction. We will end the school to prison pipeline. He didn't hold back on President Trump either. We can't wait when this administration is throwing children fleeing violence into cages. Supporters of all ages and races at the rally say they believe in the presidential hopeful. It's words of hope. And what more can you ask for? He's a strong man with good heart, and uh, I believe he believes in what he, he, he is uh, talking about. He cares about the little man, and he cares about kitchen table issues, and he's for the people. He's a genuine guy. His policies resonate. He comes from an inner city. Um, and he, he's a real change maker. And Senator Cory Booker spent a lot of time with his supporters even after he took the stage. This again is the beginning of his two week tour across the country. Some of the crucial states that he will be hitting Iowa, Georgia, and Nevada. In Newark, New Jersey, Jennifer Bisram, Dix 11 News.